You must see the difference between, on the one hand, a 1%, a small minority that was, being, that was essentially powerless being persecuted by a majority, and on the other hand, a small minority that is extremely powerful, that has all the resources of modern society and wealth being persecuted, I'll grant you, by a majority, namely the other 99%, although the group you're actually referring to is at various times several hundred protesters who are angry. Well, um, no, I think the parallel holds. I mean, the typical German had never met a Jew, but some of the Jews were extremely wealthy, and they owned the large department stores and so forth and so forth. So they were very prominent, and I, I think it's, it's a very good parallel. You're saying that the average, uh, pro the average Occupy Wall Street protester uh, has never met a rich person or somebody who rides a Google bus. Is that, is that your point? Probably, you know, I think so. But, but do, you, do you concede the point that, now you're speak, you've chosen to speak for the 1%. I admire you for, your, not only do you have the courage of your convictions, but you have them repeatedly, right? This isn't the first time you've stepped up to defend yourself. But the 1% has certain advantages and ways of defending itself that a, a, an ethnic group that is being persecuted that is small does not. And I, I, and I bring I, these up to ask I, you. I think we, we, I've sort of answered that already. I think if, the, if the Germany had had American gun laws, uh, there would have never been a Hitler. No, that's controversial. That's if Nazi Germany had gun laws. If Germany had America's gun laws. America's gun laws, making guns uh, uh, widely available to, 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 to the launch. public. Yes. That the, the Jews then would Hitler have been able to defend themselves. To Interesting. So oh, there. You think? <laughs> so so we're, we're, we're really straying off to topic, and we won't dwell on it, but okay. you're, you're a fan of our current gun laws. <laughs> no, not particularly, but it's in our Constitution. I'm, an, a fan, I'm a fan of that. I don't have any guns. <laughs>